I realised I never actually intro this video, so that's always really helpful. So um, I'll do that now and then we'll go back in time. And um, Fred's also here to help with the intro, obviously. Um, hi guys, welcome back. So today is a little bit of a different one. We're all on the phone today, it's a little bit more vlog style. And this is my morning routine for when I'm working from home. So last week I put up a blog post around, like, it was just frequently asked questions about working from home. And um, so if you want to know more about why I work from home, what I do, everything like that, then like I'll link that below so you can find it and you can see it easily. Um, but essentially I am in marketing, My I have worked for a global company, the closest office is based in London and I am a contracted remote worker but I am still I'm full time and you know employed and everything like that, I just work from home, we have a few of them so it's nothing like new or crazy. Um, I, yeah I like working from home, it definitely has its perks and after that post like I kind of mentioned that I might do a morning routine because that's something I get asked a lot in terms of like, don't you just work in your pyjamas? No. I mean, yes, for some of it, as you will see, but no, no, no. Um, so yeah, I wanted to do a full morning routine, just like a random, typical one. Today is a Tuesday, so I'm filming this on the same day that I'm putting this up, which is why it's a little bit later. Um, but I hope you guys like it. If you do, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. If you have any other questions or you want me to do any more kind of working from home videos, then just let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button, which is down here. I think. Um, and yeah, without further ado, let's rewind in time so you get a really grotty, just woken up style, Lisa. Morning. Oh, I look pretty in the morning. It is just gone like eight. Um, I've just kind of been sat in bed for a few minutes, just going through time hop social stuff. I always do this before I get up. I kind of like my alarm goes off, snooze it for a couple of times. And then I just kind of browse my phone. And then, yeah, I'm just about to get up, go to the toilet, and then I'm just gonna go and make myself a coffee and give Fred some breakfast. Um, and this is how I start my day. I'm so not a morning person. Fred. Hi. Do you want breakfast? Yeah. Yeah. You want breakfast? No. You give me mixed messages here, mate. Come on. Come on. Breakfast. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, yum, yum. This is his second half of breakfast, by the way. He's going for a second breakfast and people think he's fat, but he is basically a gluttonous cat, which means he eats too quickly and he throws up because cats' birth, like stomachs are horizontal, whereas ours are vertical, so gravity obviously helps us bring stuff down. Um, cats don't have that and he throws up so we yeah we have to give him his breakfast and his dinners in two parts two parts <laughs> I'm wearing Aladdin top and friends shorts I do have the other half of both pyjamas, but he doesn't like to wear mismatched pyjamas because I know I do. I do. I didn't really have to get really satisfied just watching it continually drip. That doesn't mean.
Cheers, morning. Oh yeah, there's a lot of crap down here. Oh. And then this is my office floor right now. It's delightful, right? Delightful. I need this. This is killing me. I have like all of the office decorated now. It's just driving me mad. <laughs> anyway, so just kind of give an idea on how I kind of organise my week and what I do. So on Mondays, I will basically write out my priority list for the week. I'm not necessarily going to show you that. <laughs> but there'll be certain things that I want to achieve that week. And my role has changed um, the past kind of couple of months. And ooh a little bit before that so it used to be very task based and I'm a marketing so it used to be very kind of execution based do this do this do this by this date sort of thing um but it's changed to more like project focus now so um we have kind of certain things that we want to achieve for the month um so for like the next three or four weeks kind of like sprints and then we will I've been looking down there because my camera's usually down there but it's up here now um yeah, so we have sprints, so for each week I'll write down all the priorities and everything that I want to be able to do that week or that I need to do that week. Um, and I'll generally then put like days next to it on when I think I'll be able to get that done or when I think I'll be doing it, stroke deadlines. Um, and then what I'll do is for each day I'll just put down a list of certain things that I need to do, even like little things like, um, so yesterday at work I just consolidated the company credit card. Uh, which isn't something that I would usually do, but it's just something I'm doing for now. Um, oh, my hair's annoying me. Something I'm doing for uh, now until we get somebody in to do it. Um, and like Mondays, I generally have like a lot of admin things like refresh and do this report, um, make sure that like this is communicated, check this. It's a very kind of admin day Monday. Um, and I had like a few meetings as well. So each day I'll just kind of put in what I want to do for that day. Um, make sure that like if I have any meetings for that day I'm prepared for it um, which again is something I'll look at on Monday when I do my priorities and like okay I've got this meeting therefore I need to look at this before that um, so yeah that's definitely kind of what I'll do each week um, and then I also do myself a little kind of home post-it so I've actually got these they're kind of like post-its but they're uh, static notes um, so it will literally just kind of sit on here but it just kind of moves around so it's more static and I'll just write a list of kind of just things I need to do at home as well because generally it's me that ends up doing it um, and I'll be like can you just do this, can you just do this, it's just easier if you do this, can you just do this um, and last week I had like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I had eight like things I had to do and I did four of them <laughs> because obviously work then it takes priority during the day, so um, yeah, I've still got a couple of things I need to do on there for this week. Um, but that's generally how I'll just organise. I'll write everything down in my book. Um, so this book that I use for like my to-do lists and stuff is just from Paper Chase. My um, older brother and his girlfriend got it me for Christmas. I love the size of this, and everybody that sees it, they're like, oh my god, I really need that. That's so good. Um, and generally I'll use that for like um, priorities, to-do lists, and like weekly catch-ups with my manager or anybody else. And then for like actual kind of notes and stuff I've just got like a smaller notebook that I kind of write everything in um, and I like to just keep the two separate it just seems to work better for me 
Um, and yeah, that's generally kind of how I'll organise my week. So I'm just gonna, I need to do a couple of admin bits. Um, so I'm gonna do that while I finish my coffee and then we will get on with the next part of my routine. So it's just gone 10 o'clock and unfortunately this is what happens. I basically sit and <laughs> end up caught up in my emails for like an hour and a half before I can actually get washed and dressed. But that is what I'm doing now. By the way, I know people are gonna say, what about breakfast? Um, I'm going through a phase of not having breakfast right now, which I know is bad, by the way. I know people are probably going to moan at me about that, but I go through phases. Right now, my phase is I would rather, I don't know, I'm just not feeling breakfast right now. Um, so, that is that. I, I, do, I go through phases. Give me a couple of weeks and I'll be back having breakfast. <laughs> but, um, yes, I'm not having breakfast at the moment, so I am just going to... Wash. I'm not going to shower because we went to the gym last night, so I had shower then. So I'm <laughs> just going to do a quick wash, wash my face, brush my teeth, uh, get dressed, and I'm just going to put a little bit of makeup on, not too much. No, I am going to put makeup on. Yeah, we'll do a makeup day today. We'll do that. So yeah. Get washed and dressed before I get dressed up because otherwise that's just stupid. Obviously, I do wash my face each night and I do a skincare routine at night. But just for like the morning, I just like to do another kind of quick clean. Um, if I'm in the shower, I use my Glossier Milky Jelly Cleanser and I just do that as part of like my wash. Um, but this morning I am just using the Garnier, it's their Milk Micellar. Um, in terms of makeup removal, that wasn't great, but I do like it in the morning because it's quite gentle. And where I had my face waxed last week, I just want to use really gentle stuff on my skin. So yeah, I'm just giving that a bit of a clean, just with like a cotton pad, and then um, yeah, that's what we're doing with that. Do a quick spritz of my trusty La Roche Posay Zero Sink, which I have used for years. By the way, it's basically the only toner I use, and it's one that's supposed to be like suitable for acne prone skin and um, I do get spots especially when I'm hormonal but also where I was a wax last week I had so many spots come up and this has just been a godsend at sorting them out um, and I have one coming up under my skin here which you can't see yet but it's really annoying so I just kind of spray a little bit on a cotton bed and just kind of area a little bit more because I'm weird and then just using my Neutrogena Hydro Boost Serum just one pump of that pop that on the face I don't have a mirror above my sink by the way it's the most frustrating thing about my bathroom it's really annoying i got one when we first moved in but it's just never gone up so it's handy 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 Okay, now makeup wise, it would honestly depend on what I'm doing that day. Um, at the moment where I'm filming pretty much every day, I'm using so much makeup um, and putting so much on my skin, um, which I don't think is helping. But I didn't put any makeup on yesterday because I went to the gym, so if I am going to the gym in the evening, unless I'm doing filming during the day, I won't put makeup on. And generally I'll put it on for filming and then I'll take it off again. I won't really wear makeup to the gym because I just think it's kind of gross like you're sweating and your makeup and ugh. um although it's a very good way to test out makeup products i will say that like the rimmel scandalize liquid liner that was awesome 
Um, but I am actually going out for lunch today, so, and I do need to film a video for tomorrow as well. So, um, I am going to put some makeup on. It's not going to be super, super makeup. Um, it's just going to be very kind of natural every day. So, I'm just going to make my sponge damp. Also, I'm going to make this super speedy for you so you don't necessarily have to, like, watch everything I am doing. But if you want me to do a video on, like, my natural makeup, let me know. I can absolutely do that. Natural makeup done. Let's go find an outfit for the day. Okay, so what do we want to wear today? Do we want to wear white jeans? Do we want to wear my green trousers, which I love, Adam hates? Do I want to wear a dress? Okay, so I'm just wearing this like little yellow smock dress. Um, it's not sunny outside, but I wanted to wear it, and I've just put some tights with it. I'll probably just wear like in my boots or my Converse, like my leather jacket and like some sort of scarf, and that will just kind of be my outfit. But I do need to pick my jewellery for the day, so it's I don't even know why I do this because it ends up being the same. So I'm probably gonna pick my. Let's say my horn because I do every day. Um, I will pr pick my Olivia Burton watch. Um, do I fancy? No, I don't fancy hoops today. I think I'm just going to go for. Do I want to wear these or do I just want to wear some studs today? I think I just want to wear some studs. I'm just going to wear my top shop triangles and just put something in the top of my ear. And yeah, I think that'll be it. And then I'm just going to spritz myself with this which is the Nectarine Blossom and Honey fragrance. And I am now somewhat beautiful. So, the rest of the day, or the rest of the morning, oh, I thought there was a light on there, but there's not. Um, I am just gonna go back upstairs. I will work again for up until lunchtime, so I am meeting my friend Amber for lunch. So I'll work until then, and then, yeah, we'll, Go from there, you can stay with me. We'll see how the morning goes.
this is what I have to do, not just in the mornings. Actually, this is generally the right amount of time he comes up. He comes up just before lunchish, um, and then he comes up again maybe about half four if he's not out. If it's unless it's nice, and then he'll be outside. But um, yeah, he will come. He will sit on my notebook, and he will try and eat my pen because apparently it's the coolest thing in the world to try and eat. Anyway, I'm going to be doing some more admin stuff before I've got a few meetings this afternoon that have come in now. Um, so I'm just going to carry on doing some more admin stuff, emails, that kind of stuff. Um, and then that will take me up to lunch, which would be nice. So, fun time. This is literally what I have to put up with on a daily basis. Him trying to find any kind of space on the desk. And my routine is trying to still work while he's being a huge pain in the ass. Isn't that right? Yes, you are a pain in the ass. Don't deny it. I see you looking all innocent there. Okay, so it is, I'm just about to wrap up for the morning, um, I need to head off to have lunch with my friend, so that is basically my morning routine, it's getting up, it's having some coffee, um, sometimes breakfast today, not so much, sometimes shower, not so much today, um, and just kind of getting washed and dressed and ready, um, trying to stop this one from completely wrecking. My day also managed to book my carpet this morning, so that's been done. Very excited about having the flooring done, aren't we? Yes, yes we are. Um, lots of admin stuff done. I've done my to-do list and everything, so I've replied to lots of emails. I've managed to get it under to 300 as well, which um, is so nice. Um, but yeah, but that is my morning routine. I hope you guys like it. If you do have any questions, obviously pop them below in the uh, comments box. Um, or if you want to see more kind of routines for like working from home and stuff, um, or more stuff on like how I stay organised and motivated, like absolutely throw those in as well, that's fine. But yeah, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will see you all again tomorrow with another video I'm not sure what yet. Still haven't decided. What video should we do tomorrow? Dunno. But yeah, I will see you then. Bye. Say bye Fred. Bye Fred. He's so helpful. He's the most helpful assistant in the world. <laughs>